Hi everyone, how's it going? SPX has made the all-time high in December 2021. It gives you a nice return of 31.29% from the lowest price in January 2021 till the highest price in December 2021. So, if we can compare SPX to the other top 50 stocks under S&P 500, I can show you the top 10 gainers of S&P 500 companies in the next few minutes. So, stick around with Crypto and Sam Usa. My name is Dude and I'll be right back with the list. In number 10, we have Home Depot INC, a retail trade home improvement chain. If you guys bought HD at the lowest price in March and sold it in December, you can get a nice return of 70.57%. It's a decent return. Next, we have Google Class A. It's one of the most expensive stock in S&P 500. However, it gave you a nice return of 78.02% from January to November 2021. Well played by Google keeping up their both stocks on par. In number 8, Google Class C gave you a nice return of 78.75% from January to November 2021. From the banking sector, we have Wells Fargo, which had made a return of 78.81% from January to November 2021. That has made our list number seven. Pfizer's stock price soared up to 61.71 US dollar per share in December right after the announcement of high efficacy of their new Paxlovid pill. If you guys bought in February 2021 and sold it in December 2021, you had made a nice return of 84.98%. In number 5 is Costco Wholesale that had made a good return of 86.15% from March to December last year. It was an incredible return from Intuit INC from January to November 2021. The stock soared to 716.86 US dollars a share and it gives you a nice return of 100.41%. Coming to number 3, it's Semicon Company AMD. Despite the supply chain crisis from this industry, AMD has made a significant amount of return of 126.84% from May to November 2021. Despite what Elon had done selling off his shares of his company, it had not stopped the stock price soaring as high as $1,243.49 per share in November last year. Tesla had given a nice return of 130.49% within 9 months. The clear winner is NVIDIA Corporation, a staggering amount of 199.71% in return has made this stock our number one of top 10 gainers from 50 selected companies of S&P 500. And that's all for the list, uh, I got a fun facts for this uh, top gainers list 
I've created some data that I would like to share with you and you probably can check from the link on the description. Most of the stocks had made their lowest price point in January and the other month will be in March. Another thing is most of the stock had met their highest price point in December and November respectively. I have provided a link for you who are interested with the data for all the 50 selected companies for your reference only. Okay that's all from me. I hope you guys enjoyed my video and please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks a lot for your time and happy new year. See you all.